Before the days of smart power meters, a person known as a meter reader would walk around the neighborhood taking monthly readings from each house. Using their handheld computer, they knew if a gate was locked and where to find the key. They knew if there were dogs in the yard and whether they were friendly or not. Things that are valuable to know before entering a person's property. But you're probably thinking, where can I get a sweet Jeep like that? And how did he find out all this information about the power company? Simple. I purchased one of these on eBay in an untested condition, meaning the seller has no idea whether it works or not. And if you're quick, you can see how I accessed the power company's data. Did you catch it? Let me rewind a bit. That's right. The compact flash memory card is still inside. But let's not get too far ahead of ourselves. We still have to finish reading this customer's meter. Lock up. Hide the key back under the planter and head back to the office so we can upload this data and clock out. Now let's head into the lab to see if we can get this eBay special to work. I only paid $30 for it, and they sell brand new for $2,600. Even a replacement battery is $325, but I don't think that'll be necessary. Even though these lithium cells were dead, hooking them directly to a power supply, bypassing the protection circuitry, sometimes works. You have to wire directly to the battery internally, because the external battery connector could be electrically disconnected using a MOSFET if the protection chip marked the battery as bad. Determine the appropriate charging voltage and current, and then sit back and wait but make sure to watch the battery for any anomalies 